In 2007, Kanto's first big hit was an award-winning Apple docking station for the original iPod. Their huge success launched a line of fantastic powered speakers and audio accessories. Today, Kanto creates an assortment of products that look as good as they sound, and they include a lot of features for the affordable prices. Previously, we gave you our Kanto U-Series powered speaker comparison, where we compared the U2, U4, and U6 bookshelf speaker models all together. At Audio Advice, we think Kanto's desire to bake great performance and high visual aesthetics into every model they create is evident in their U-Series bookshelf and desktop speakers. In this review, we're going to focus on the Kanto U6 powered desktop speakers as an upgrade to near-field listening with turntables or music streaming services with computers. The U6 is a two-way bookshelf speaker that has a studio monitor type look with the woofers and silk dome tweeters exposed. We like how Kanto makes the U6 available in so many different colors and finishes. There are five colors to choose from which can either stand out and catch people's attention or just blend in with your room's decor. Audio Advice is the exclusive dealer of the high performance gloss red that just looks fantastic sitting on a modern piece of furniture. But for an understated, more minimalistic look that blends more into your room, a matte white or matte black finish are also available. And for those who want a cool retro aesthetic to complement a turntable or a computer desk, bamboo or walnut finishes are also available for a stylish and more mid-century vibe. If your favorite sports team is red like NCSU near us, they're a perfect way to show off your school colors. When setting up the U6s, we immediately noticed the craftsmanship of the perfectly smooth edges and high quality connections on the rear. The speakers are around 10 pounds each, so they definitely have some weight to them for their size. Now, we do recommend a speaker stand like the Kanto SP Series 32 or 26. If you're aiming to put them on a tabletop, we also recommend using desktop speaker stands like the S6 to separate the speakers from the table since they do have some pretty low end bass and it could cause some feedback. Kanto also makes two smaller models, the U2 and U4, which are very similar speakers, but just a little bit smaller. To see more of the differences these three models have, you can watch our comparison video that we'll link in the description that compares all three models. The U6 has both larger speaker drivers and a beefier amplifier than the U2 and U4. However, Kanto keeps the one inch silk dome tweeter and upgrades to a five inch Kevlar driver. Like the U4, the U6 is ported in the back for improved bass response. A 100 watt Class D amplifier is built into the left speaker, which is enough power to fill a decently sized living room with some rocking tunes. The U6 has dual Toslink optical inputs, RCA inputs with a phono switch, a subwoofer out, 3.5 aux input, a USB type A charging port, gold plated binding post terminals to connect the left and right speakers, and best of all, Bluetooth 4.0 streaming. In the box there's a 6 foot power cord, a nice remote control with batteries, a 16 foot speaker wire, a 6.5 foot stereo mini jack cable, and self adhesive rubber feet. We find this ready to go type of packaging ideal for someone who's just getting started and doesn't wanna to have to worry about buying a lot of additional cables just to get up and running. Using the optical inputs, you can easily connect to your TV and putting these speakers on stands to the right and left of your TV will give your movie watching experience a serious boost of immersion, especially if you're still using the sound straight from your TV. The U6 hold their own and even outperform many sound bars in the same category. With a subwoofer RCA output, you can add the Kanto Sub 8 and have even more bottom end when watching your favorite movies for an extremely affordable price. With the recent resurgence of vinyl, we're frequently asked for recommendations on the best powered speakers to pair with a turntable, and the U6 does not disappoint. They have an RCA left and right input along with the ground post if needed, and one of our favorite features is a small switch on the back that allows you to flip the RCA inputs from phono to line, depending on if you're using a turntable that has a preamp built in or not. Now this is super cool because it doesn't matter if you have a turntable without a preamp, you can just use the amp built right into the U6s and switch the phono and you're good to go. This feature saves a lot of hassle of adding a bulky preamp to your turntable that you just got. The U6s also have Bluetooth 4.0 Aptex technology, allowing you to stream high quality audio directly from any Bluetooth enabled device. Bluetooth 4.0 Aptex is an audio codec that can support up to 24 bit audio transmission that reduces signal and noise transmission, giving you a lot less distortion. Having this feature makes them easy to connect and stream your favorite song without having to worry about quality loss via your transmission. However, the lack of Bluetooth 5.0 does limit these speakers for a future, and if we could upgrade one thing about them, we would probably pick that. 
An aux input is also available and it's great for plugging in a phone or a tablet for a quick streaming playback option if you don't want to connect to the Bluetooth. Now on a desk, they're perfect for filling up the office with sound and with a few additional accessories, you can really upgrade the sound coming from your powered speakers. Whether it's background music or typing a report, Zoom calls to hear your coworkers loud and clear, or just watching YouTube videos, the U6s have you covered. On the front, there's a small black knob that you can easily and quickly change the volume if needed and you don't want to use the remote. Now, the remote is also well built and has tactile buttons that can change from the sources, the bass treble, the volume, and connect to Bluetooth and anything else you pretty much need to do, you could do it right from the remote. We tested the U6s in a couple different scenarios that we could see people using them commonly for. To start, we put them on the SP32 speaker stands and we plugged them into our TV to watch some movies. We started the movie Encanto because we thought the music in this would really put the speakers to the test. And surprisingly, we were really blown away by how well these speakers did. They painted the voices and the songs across the entire room. This made the movie a lot more fun to watch and it was a pretty fun experience to be able to hear the different voices clearly coming in and the singing and all the different scenes. A really cool option with these would be to put a turntable under your TV and have them connected to the TV and your turntable and you could switch with the remote back and forth super easily. Now, with the return of vinyl, the U6s are a perfect combo for your turntable. We connected these U6s to a Project RPM1 carbon turntable in red that matched the gloss red of the Cantos. And these not only looked sleek, but they also sounded fantastic while listening to vinyl. But when we didn't have the vinyl album we were looking for and we just wanted to play something on the fly, we easily connected it to our phone via Bluetooth and pulled up our favorite playlist. This is a really nice touch to be able to use your turntable and listen to it, but if you don't have the album on vinyl, you can just connect your phone and use Bluetooth. Now, finally, we set these speakers on S6 desktop stands and put them on a desk. Working while playing Kobas in the background was a pleasure. The song Happier Than Ever is a fun tune by Billie Eilish that really puts these speakers to work. You could hear the subtle breathiness of Billy's voice between the words, along with the background vocals and instruments perfectly separated during the first half of the entire song. During the second half, Billy takes it up a notch and the whole band kicks in with some solid bass and instrumentation. As I turned them up, the low end really shined here, and each hit of the bass you could really feel in your chest. These filled the entire office I was working in with really deep bass and a really warm sound that was fun and easy to listen to and didn't fatigue me at all, even after hours of listening. Now, whether you're thinking about upgrading your TV sound, need a pair of desk speakers, or you want to pair these up with your turntable, we think everyone needs a pair like the Kanto U6s in their household. Solely based on they have a lot of good connectivity options, and they're a good starter speaker for your turntable, your TV, or just to listen to music while you're working. Since Kanto makes these in five different colors and three different sizes, we think you'll be able to find a Kanto U speaker that matches the look and size that you need. And here at Audio Advice, we are the exclusive dealer of the Kanto Reds, so if you want to get a pair of these gloss reds, check out our website. We'll link it in the description below. If you like this video, make sure you hit the like button, subscribe, and hit the notification bell so you don't miss any of our latest content. Also, make sure you check us out on audioadvice.com or give us a call, chat with us on our website. We'll be happy to hear from you. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.